This video shows how to snapshot drop-down menus using delayed image capture. So sometimes you're working in software and you're maybe trying to explain something to somebody like they say, hey, I can't do what you asked me to do, I don't see what you see, or you're trying to create notes showing people how to do what you're talking about, or you might even just be saying, you know, show me your menu. And, and they might say, I can't, it's a drop-down menu as soon as I go to click on something to snapshot it, I can't see it anymore. Well, luckily there's a way to get around that. So what you can do is you can use in Windows, if you, even if you don't have a proprietary software, you can use the snipping tool. So if, if you go to search uh, the Windows bar and click or start typing snip, it'll automatically come up as a slipping, the snipping tool application. And then there's this part right here where it says delay. And so what that is, is it's literally a delay before it takes the snapshot. So instead of it being like right now. So you can click this drop down menu and you can say how long of a delay do you want? And I'm going to say like four seconds. And then as soon as you go to do it, you're going to go to whatever it is you're trying to do. Like, see, as soon as if I were to click off of that, it just, it's gone, right? As soon as, if I'm trying to tell somebody like, hey, type in the search under the filter and they're like, what? I don't have to try to explain that to them for 10 minutes. I can just wait. I can, like, I can click, I go back to my snipping tool and I'm going to say I want a new snip, right? So I've already set my delay. You can see for four seconds, I'm going to say new. So I'm going to say new snip. And then as soon as I hit this, I need to go do what I'm going to do quickly to get to the menu because you only have that four seconds. But then once the four seconds goes, you'll see it's going to lock my screen. And then that is what allows you to capture that menu. So I'm going to say new. I'm going to go to my menu and I'm going to click here and wait. Oh, and then there it is. Now I suppose, so now my screen is locked. And so see, I can click and nothing's going to happen. So I'm going to say I want to snip this and I might not want the whole thing. I might just actually want like this menu. So maybe I just go like this. And then snipping tool is going to come up with that image that I just created. So now that I have my image in the snipping tool, you can see that I have my drop down menu where if I would have not used that delay tactic, as soon as I go here and I try to go click on snipping tool, it goes away. Like it's not in the background, see? So there's no almost no other way to get it. So using the delayed image capture is how we are able to capture these drop down menus, whether it's just trying to get somebody to the same place or show them what you're talking about or have see what they're seeing, because in your mind you think it should look different. And maybe you're just in different places or even just create notes on how to do something. So it's a great way to do documentation of things like that. So that is how you snapshot drop down menus using delayed image capture.